Alright guys, I uh, finally got around to buying myself a plug spinner. I've been meaning to get one of these for a long time and uh, kept putting it off because it, uh, it wasn't really an essential thing. Um, but I could have done with one a while ago so I thought, right, it's time to buy one of these fucking things. So, there it is. Um, it's the ICL spinner and i um, going to let you see it in action with this uh, shit master lock. And the reason I'm using this one to demonstrate is because master locks, well these ones here, they're actually exactly the same to pick as the cheapy laminated ones. Um, but this particular one actually gave me a bit of a headache the first time I was picking it. Very, uh, very shallow set in pin 3 and then pin 4 in behind it the set is quite deep so I was fanning about with that for quite a while the first time there she goes um, so I think whenever I first picked that I was probably at it for about 10 minutes which is absolutely ridiculous for a master lock usually you just go in pop 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 when it's open um, it won't rake clockwise, um, I have tried, but of course it will rake very, very easily anti-clockwise, just like that. Of course if you turn it anti-clockwise it doesn't actually open the shackle. So what we're going to do is uh, just let you actually see if I can focus that. That's the way that locks in. And this will probably pop the shackle open as well. Whenever we we'll do it, just trying to get this at an angle where you can see it, but I'm not going to be able to. So there she goes. So that would have turned a. Um, <laughs> if I had had that back in the day, that would have turned that from a, a ten minute job into a fucking thirty second job. So plug spinners, get one. Um, again, that's the ICL one. Um, I think I got that from Walker Locksmiths. Not a bad wee piece of kit, that. And uh, I'm not sure if this is going to hold up for very long, but um, you could replace it with a wiper insert. It's easy enough to take apart. So, yeah, I would recommend that. I think they're about 30 quid. So, if you're uh, looking for a, a cheapish spinner and uh, you don't want to get the claw one, because uh, I don't like the design of the, the sort of pistol y type. Um, so if you fancy something a bit more like that, definitely worth getting. So just wanted to let you see that doing its thing. Um, that's it for the day. Cheers.